so <laughs> Steve can do it too. Steve from accounting, and this is when it's quarter. Okay. Uh, Seventeen. Yep. Uh, Thank you. Yeah. You guys are good. Good luck. Uh, okay, winner of this space is here. Wait, well, yeah, I get an extra five? So here we go. Yeah. 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 Is that? No, okay. No, 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 no. Catch his jump, but he, he doesn't hit him. What did you want to say? Yeah, I don't know if you're going to take for his job. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Good. Right. I was just trying to so, double check what happened. I think we're good. Okay. Yeah, Pokies will be doing a lot of just throwing out frisbees and a lot of neutral bees when they're at like a uh, great distance. But now disadvantage. Ooh. See, Steve actually played a little bit of PM early today, so hopefully he doesn't um get mixed up by uh, how the Falcon and that works. Ah, oh, goes for back air. See, in situations like those, sometimes you want to just 50-50 it because they'll be DIing out, so they're gonna die from back air a lot earlier than they should. Now off stage, uses his jump. Uppies early, ooh, that was risky. That being said, Pokesies does like to gimp low. When he fights Falcon, at least from what I've seen. So I, do, I do go off it versus him. Ooh, okay, he still has his jump. Uppies early to get to the platform, that was smart. Ooh, and a stray back air. Can he edge guard? Okay, that was a really good angle there from Pokesies. Whoa! God damn it. That was dumb. <laughs> he got a little bit aggressive at the ledge there, but he could still pull it off. See, at that percent, I wouldn't do up air knee. He's too high percent for that. If he was at 80, it would have been fine. But now, Steve, he's going to get a little bit hungry because, um, because, you know, he's behind now and he's at 45 already. So, big back air right there. Now, from what I noted, from playing with coaches, you really have to hit Sword Fighter himself as opposed to where the hitbox is. It's, it's kind of tough to catch his uppie. It's easier to catch his regular uppie, the default one, but that one... Oh my god, okay, good drift there. <laughs> See, if I, at that angle, I would have... Okay, good back air. I would have probably uh, back air to get to the stage. But now, let's see if Steve can push the momentum hard and make this comeback for game one. Ooh, almost got a tipman up there. Darren neutral, Roots would be proud. He didn't jab at Lidge, what the hell? And it's usually because you beat yeah. Oh! Try to catch him! <laughs> oh! Well, that's He'll take his time. Falcon keeps on the pocket. He does that all the time. I never do that. And tries to land aggressively. That's his mistake in game one for Poke Cheese. From IT. And normally the question is, who will Steve go? But he's locked into one character, so he can't switch. He cannot switch. He is staying Falcon no matter what. So. And now they receive their doubles money. Give up. Yeah, so I'm hosting another tournament tomorrow. You're all invited if you want. We're going to PM. I want to go to your Friday. I'm reviewing a Behemoth album tomorrow. <laughs> Alright, so game two, where are they gonna go? If I was Steve, I'd run it back. Smashville's my favorite stage, Smashville's Falcon's best stage. Um, but if he has a comfort pick, Battlefield, okay, he likes the triplats. Maybe he'll live a lot longer. Um, so we'll see, we'll see how it goes for Steve. Steve from to F0. Steve from Port Town. All right, so the neutral, he's got he's to slowly approach. You see, he keeps running in, and the way he uses his movement, his dash dances, has not been very good. Good high recovery there. It's been mixing him up. I mean, I was playing with Pochies earlier today. I was going low a lot more. Jade, why don't you just... Where is she? Oh, she's over there. Wait, was that you who said that? Yeah. Oh. Well, then why didn't you just say it on the mic? You're sitting right beside me. God damn it, Ben. Anyway, it's not looking good for Steve right now. I could tell he probably thought about landing aggressively, but he knew it was a bad idea. Here we go. Can you get something going? Like a little John Steve. John Steve? Oh, good. Oh, down smash. I'm not sure if that's what he wanted. That's a little, off it, uh, a little iffy. But in a position like that, where Poachers are forced to go at that angle, it's worth stomping. 
how I play it. That's reasonable. <laughs> It's one of those times where it's like you know what you fucked up and like you should just move on. That's what I get for my place. But it's the best thing to think about. See, like, he had. It's, it's that's one of the worst feelings. You try to um. I didn't just wait and do back air, but it doesn't. Like it barely doesn't come out. Oh, he dodged the F tilt with down smash. God damn. I don't want to see it happen like this. The Christopher Robin challenge didn't go for nothing. I want Steve to bring it back. If I can beat Pokey Sword Fighter, he can too. This is Jade's water bottle, and then I'll oh, go to the air yeah. Will he stop? He goes for it, but he misses. I haven't seen any jab at ledges, either. He puts the John and John Madden. Oh, no! Okay, there are some hitboxes on that up B that will gimp you. It was That was scary. Okay, back throw should not kill here. There you go, good stop. You can see he nailed me on his head. You can't really catch him with the hitboxes. You have to hit his body. Like, you really have to place yourself where his body is, because the space in front is all hitbox. Alright, here we go. Ah, oh, misses the nair. See, what happens with Rage, it's so annoying. The, um... Rage hurts our early combos. Good air dodge back on stage from Pokies. No! Okay, I did not want to see a gimp like that. Ooh, wanted to get knee. The platform got in the way. That being said, he's still got a good position. Now he's off stage. Let's see this. Oh my god. Not like this. And Steve from Port Town. All right. Was that two overs? Uh, Q and Poke Cheese on stream. I would honestly say 